I'm at a secret studio in Munich, Germany. I'm here for the IAA, the International Auto Show, to see a new family of Mercedes-Benz cars that they have made for the future of driving, and they've used incredible materials, including garbage. Want to take a look? So here it is, the CLA class of vehicles. Now, it'll come in both gas and electric. It's just a concept for now. This vehicle will actually have four vehicles that come out of it. There'll be this, the sedan, there'll be a shooting brake and two SUVs. And in the electric version, they're saying 750 kilometers on a single charge of electricity. The direct translation is around 466 miles. Now, that's on the WELP cycle, the German cycle. If you take it to the American EPA cycle, we're talking about 350 to 400 miles on a single charge of electricity. That's pretty amazing. But we'll have to wait until about 2024 before we actually get the car in the United States. And then it'll be slightly different. It's the production car. But let's take a look at this stunning design. Take a look at this beautiful design and the light sequence as well. 275 lit stars at the front here and they have lamellas around the outside and that includes the big Mercedes-Benz star at the front. Reverse uh, shark nose grille here at the front and these beautiful headlights as well which are set back. Now if you come around the front it includes the Mercedes-Benz star that's actually on the hood here. They have 21 inch wheels here at the side. They have lamellas in the middle. Those stars again reflected on the inside of those wheels and come down the side of this vehicle. Look at this huge muscular back end. Inset door handles. Although it's a CLA a size vehicle and fairly small it looks like a big muscle car and looks more luxurious than its size actually depicts and you get around the back of the vehicle and again like a Studebaker it looks the same at the back as it does at the front it has those star lights as the tail lights and then this piece of glass it has 652 stars embedded in the glass roof which goes all the way from the trunk all the way to the front. The inside definitely looks like something from a sci-fi movie once you get in here. And it's a cornucopia of recharged materials and recycled materials. You'll know that when I start to explain them. Let's get through what some of these are. This silver segment here, this is actually paper. They've used paper to make this segment here, a recharger, a cup holder, and down at the bottom here, this is actually the brains of this AI car. This MBOS is a water-cooled system. That is the chip that is running the vehicle. Now, the leather in these seats is dyed with actually parts of the coffee bean that are waste and that goes for all the leather on the inside of the vehicle. There is a strap on the inside of the door here which is made from fake silk and that fake silk they use bacteria and garbage to actually create that fake silk. Now this material here in the middle that's the old soda bottles that you threw into the recycling the pet bottles and they use that to make this material and the floor mats well, that's actually bamboo uh, once they spin it and put it through a whole bunch of really cool processes. So you can see by looking around this car, it's a ton of really cool recycled materials. Now, there's also a lot of other cool stuff about this vehicle. It will actually recharge in a super fast amount of time. It's on the 800 volt system, and that means you can actually charge it in record amounts of time. Plus, you'll find that this vehicle actually will be ready when it comes to market in 2024 for level three autonomy. And that means that you should be able to take your eyes off of the road, your hands off of the wheel, and your feet off of the pedals, and the car will do the driving. That's the aim of Mercedes-Benz, but we'll have to wait and see when it actually comes to market. And there's a lot more when it comes to how this vehicle is powered.
So when it comes to this vehicle, you will get over the air updates. And that means the car will always have a constant chip to cloud communication and will always be getting new information. Also, when you're sitting in the back here, you like to have wireless charging. Well, they put a wireless charging in the back so your phone can get constant charging as well. There is something called child presence detection, which means that safety, as we always hear from Mercedes-Benz, is really important to make sure the kids are always uh, identified in the vehicle and are always kept safe as well. And to make sure by 2039 that Mercedes are reducing as much of their carbon footprint on the earth as possible, this a uh, class of vehicle will have a 40% reduction in its production of CO2. So really working towards making sure that it's not only a beautiful piece of luxury, but it's also an environmentally friendly piece of luxury. You know, I've learned quite a few things while looking at this Mercedes-Benz CLA class today. Pomegranate red doesn't only look good, it tastes good as well. I'll also tell you that technology can look good and be functional at the same time. And there are limitless numbers of Mercedes-Benz stars that can be put on a car. I'm Nick Miles.